find the fourth root of 32. So let's go through that process. So we're going to find the fourth root of 32. So notice that up here, the index is 4. What does that tell us to do? we got to somehow write this number differently. So take a look. Take a look at the number 32. 32 is equivalent to, for example, 16 times 2. But that's not good because we need something that has an exponent of 4, and we don't have that yet, so we can cancel with this. So you're going to continue. Now, 16 would be 4 times 4 times the other 2 from here. Okay, so that's better. Again, though, we still don't have what we need, so we need to be able to cancel this exponent of 4. So write the 4 now as 2 times 2. Write the other 4 as 2 times 2. And write that remaining 2 this way, right here, times 2, okay? Now look at these 2's here on the bottom. Notice that there is one here, and there's another one, another one, another one here, and now 2 remaining at the end. So what does that tell us? It tells us that I can write this now as 2 to the 4th times 2. So 2 to the 4th times 2. This is a 2 here, not a Z. <laughs> so you're going to take this and you're going to write this now as the 4th root of, and then write the following next. Um, 2 to the 4th times the remaining 2 this way. you got to break it up this way. So notice now there's a 4 here in this exponent and there's a 4 in this index here. Now what you can do by a basic rule is you can distribute this over. Take a look. So you can say the 4th root of 2 to the 4th times the 4th root of 2. This is allowed, not a problem. But now notice that this cancels with this, and all that remains is 2, and then the fourth root of 2. And then you can think of this here as your answer. Thank you, friends. Please leave a like, please subscribe. I'll see you in another video.